Well, good morning, Abby. Um, my name's Paul Storey. Um, we're spending a lot of time here at the moment doing conservation work, basically clearance of rhododendron. Um, this is Crown Estate land. Um, and this place is um, Black Ball. It's near Dunster, I say on the Crown Estate. So, Paul, what does the role of Moor Keeper entail? The Moor Keeper's job now has been running for two years to start with, um, which went fairly well, and then since then it's just been bits and pieces. Just as of when the funding allows, um, we're just basically trying to look after the moor and its wildlife, and obviously the, the general public that come along with it, really. So what are the most challenging aspects of your job? Well, the most challenging part of the job, I would say, was um, tr securing the funding on a more regular basis to be able to, to carry on all the conservation work over the different sites um, and also keeping all the landowners together you know as w a one part here like a partnership and um, to, to keep the work rolling as well as it keeps stopping and starting you know you just you just lose where you're going really you know it's not just it's not continuous enough now. So how is your role helping to sustain Exmoor's woodlands? Most of the work um, is, is all conservation work grant based, there's always a grant somewhere down the line. Um, butterflies is one of the main things that um, we sort of do work to do with, um, e.g. bracken control and um, just scrub control and that sort of thing. Here where we're working now it's rhododendron, um, this has been going on, this is probably, this particular site is probably into its seventh year now, where the first year we just cut it and, and treated all the stumps and left it. Um, it's been resprayed once but um, it was just getting so difficult to get out down over and one thing or another and um, fire risk and one thing or another. So we decided to swale it this year, which has made access into this site being very steep a lot easier. So we're really just tidying up all the bits and pieces of what was left behind from previous years now. So why is your job important? Okay, um, most of the work um, is actually helping to improve habitats for all the different species on Exmoor. Um, where we can, e.g. with the scrub control and everything else that I've probably talked about elsewhere. Um, because Exmoor's wildlife is important and um, we want to see it continue and thrive. So what would you suggest people do to help conserve Exmoor's woodlands? Well, I think probably litter would be the most important. Um, Friday and Saturday nights being the worst because North Hill, etc., all the parking and that, we just end up with um, McDonald's, rubbish, etc., Indian takeaways, just bits and pieces, all in tin foil containers. Well, again, it's no good to the ponies on the moor or any other livestock. So, Paul, final question. What's your favourite place on Exmoor? My favourite place on Exmoor? I've got three, really. Um, we're Water, running up to Oldham's Burrow, Brabus and North Hill. The two later ones, I suppose, really have um, got to the top of the list because of all the conservation work I've done on the two areas and I've got to realise what two lovely places it is.